How's it going everybody? This is Beat the Bush. Today I'm going to talk about how using paper towels can actually lower your net worth. I never thought I would be using something as mundane as a roll of paper towels as the main topic of my video. You see, it's not the idea of using paper towel itself, but really the idea of using disposable paper products altogether. I've realized that after some time I've kept this roll of paper towel sort of like an ornament piece because I actually never actually use the paper towels on this thing. Normally if my hands are wet I would dry my hands with reusable towels like this or if I'm eating I would use a table napkin that's actually washable. In fact, I bought this huge pack of paper towels from Costco roughly three years ago and I still have not been able to finish all of it mainly because I've been using something that's reusable. Now let me relate how something as innocuous as these paper towels can affect your net worth. Each roll of these guys, let's say it's about a dollar and let's say you go through two rolls of these every single week, that means it's roughly a hundred dollars in paper towels that you're throwing away into the trash can. Most people when they dispose of these paper towels, they just toss it into the kitchen trash and that kitchen trash actually goes straight to the landfill. Now you see how using these paper towels is actually really bad for the environment because you're cutting down a bunch of trees, you're filling up the landfill and it also hurts your pocketbook as well. Now am I able to dry my hands just as well with these towels? Yes I am and I do rotate new ones in as soon as I feel like it's too dirty and I would go and wash these. Now $100 for these paper towels you might think eh, it's not a big deal because it is only $100 you're using these for the convenience because you don't want to always go around hunting for these towels and then maybe it might be dirty and then you have to go wash them. Well to me washing these is not that hard. Now let me just say whenever you use these paper towels over a 30 year time span, over your lifetime, if you keep on using these, then you're essentially going to be wasting upwards of $3,000 of reduction in your net worth by the time you retire. Now $3,000 you might think, oh it's not that much, maybe it's only a fraction of 1% of what you may retire with. The final idea here is not just about the paper towel itself because if it is, then yeah $3,000, eh whatever, let me just throw away $3,000 and just forget about all this trying to save money just with these $1 rolls of paper towels. The thing I'm trying to get at here is if you change your mentality of not using disposable products as much, every single item that you do not use that is disposable is going to save you a lot in the long run. For example, other kinds of disposable products that you can do away with which would help your bottom line could be doing away with coffee pods, those swifter things where the reload cartridges are really expensive, inkjet cartridges, disposable forks, bowls, and knives, and the list goes on and on. And every single item you can count on saving roughly a hundred dollars every single item that you knock off your list. Now you might think using these disposable things is going to cost you in terms of convenience but really if you change the mentality and if you're used to using reusable things then there's not that much effort involved in trying to use these, wash them, and reuse them at all. By the time you squeeze out all these disposable things out of your life, you're gonna find that you save a lot of money from not buying these things that you just toss in the trash can. One exception that I do take for using disposable products is actually buying the blue paper towels where things are going to be extremely messy and if I actually use these towels in some sort of greasy fashion, it's gonna be extremely hard to clean. It's gonna take me really, really long to clean something like that. So in that case, I would prefer to actually use disposable products so there are cases where you would use something like that but from day to day wise you don't actually need paper towels like these. I hope you enjoyed this way of thinking about buying disposable products and trying to not buy them at all because if you do this you can actually reduce your landfill usage and reduce your need for the landfill bin at all. Don't forget to give me a like on this video, comment down below, let me know if you already do something similar to this or if this video actually convinced you to actually use less disposable products. If you're interested in supporting this channel, I have an audible link down in the video description below where you can actually get a free audiobook and if you don't like the audiobook or the service, you can cancel it before the trial period ends. You can still keep the audiobook and still help benefit this channel. I also have a 30 day free trial for Gamefly down below where this is a free trial. You can actually try a game for free for 30 days and if you don't like it you can cancel it and you will not owe a thing. I also have a Patreon over here and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.